Hi everybody, and welcome to the WinTech Post, where we're bringing you all the latest news and information from WinTech Industries. Today I'm going to talk about Ampex DDR3 Overclocking Memory. Overclocking is increasing the speed of your memory beyond the industry standard. This gives you that extra edge required for high-end gaming systems. Installing overclocking memory is just like installing regular memory, but with one additional step. With me today is Charles, who's going to show us how to install the overclocking memory. So Charles, what additional steps do we need to perform? Well, you first install the memory modules into the motherboard, and then you have to go into the BIOS to manually set the, manually set the overclock settings. So these modules are rated for 1800 MHz at the CL8 and 1.9 volts, correct? Yes, that's correct. Okay, so can you show us now how to set those uh, parameters? Sure. Uh, first, you, you power on your motherboard and you have to continually hit tap the delete key. Uh, and that, that will bring you into the BIOS screen where you can manually set the, the memory settings. Uh, so each, each, each motherboard has a different uh, name for, for the overclock where the overclock settings are. On this gigabyte board, uh, it's called the Motherboard Intelligent Tweaker. And so we go into the Motherboard Intelligent Tweaker, and you can see that we have plenty of op overclocking options here. Uh, and But the ones that are most important here are the CPU host, host frequency, the, uh, the DRAM timing, uh, DRAM timing, as well as the DRAM voltage, which is at the bottom. So the first thing we need to do is to change the CPU host clock control. Uh, we have to enable that. Uh, and then we have to change the CPU host frequency from 333 MHz to 450 megahertz. Uh, and after you do that, you can see that the memory frequency went from 1333 to 18, 1800 MHz. Okay. Once, you've, once you've done that, you can change the clock latency uh, or the or the RAM timing, uh, you set that to manual, and you can change change your timings to 88824, which is what these modules are rated at. And after that, after you're done with that, you go down to the DDR3 over voltage control. The standard DDR voltage is 1.5 volts, and these these modules uh, you, you can run them all the way up to 2.1 volts. Uh, and the DDR over voltage control on gigabyte boards is expressed in uh, in volts above the standard. So if you set this to plus 0.4 volts, that'll be 1.5 volts plus 0.4 volts, which gives you 1.9 volts uh, total at the DDR3 modules. Okay, great. And uh, once we've uh, set these parameters, is there anything else we need to do? Uh, after, after you've set all your settings, you want to save them. Uh, you can do that either by just hitting, hitting F10. Uh, that works on a lot of BIOSes, and and it asks you if you want to see it, to save the CMOS and the exit, uh, and you can just hit Enter to save that. Uh, other other BIOSes, you can just go back to the main menu and go to Save and Exit Setup and hit Enter. So there we go. That's how to install overclock memory. To find out more information on the Ampex overclock memory and to get the information on all the settings you need go to ampexmemory.com. So that's WinTech, your winning choice in memory.